Hi, this is going to be a basic tutorial of how to use and operate the HD series machine from Techno CNC Systems. I'm going to start off plugging power in to the machine. This is our HD Mini. It takes 220 volt three phase power and uh, the same as our 4x8 and 5x10 HD machines. We start off by turning the machine on, hitting the green button. When the machine starts up, you'll be using this controller, this handheld controller, for any operations you have with the machine. It takes a few seconds to boot up. So before the machine, you're allowed to do anything with the machine, it's going to ask you if you'd like to go back to the reference point. This is asking if the machine can home. You'll click the OK button on the handheld, in which the machine will then home in the Z axis first, and then the X and the Y simultaneously. Once the machine has completed homing, you are able to use any of the basic functions such as jogging. On this handheld, you can see there is a Y plus, a Y minus, an X minus, an X plus, a Z plus, and a Z minus. These controls allow you to jog the machine in either of those directions. Once you get the hang of jogging the machine, you're ready to run a program. I wrote a simple sample program and saved it to this memory stick. When you're ready, you can plug the memory stick into the USB port on the machine. Once that you plug the USB in, the controller is going to ask you, find U-Disk, scan it, you click OK and then it's going to bring you to uh, the programs you have within the disk. I wrote up a simple NC file for the eight for our HD machines. Once you click you find the file that you want, you click OK. Then you'll see a check mark next to the program you want. Once you if that is the correct program, it gives you options. One is LD, which means load. 2 DE delete 3 copy for the for, if you want to load a program you're going to click on 1 it's a blue button with the number in the bottom right hand corner that'll load your program now your program is ready to run before you run the program you want to set an origin with our HD machines there are two ways to set the origin you could use this remote touchpad which uses an electronic electronic signal when the cutter touches the touchpad it then zeroes its Z axis or you could zero through the handheld by lowering down the Z axis bringing the X and the Y to where you'd like to start your program and clicking the XY equals zero button uh, for just for the sample I'm gonna have my origin be where the position is currently. Uh, I'm gonna zero my X and Y. To manually zero the Z, you're gonna you'd have to hold down Shift and click on the X Y equals zero. If you look at the bottom left hand corner of all the buttons, there's other pictures indicating that they are can also be used for other functions. These functions can all be used by holding down shift and then clicking the corresponding buttons. You would place your touchpad underneath your cutter, click shift, 
zero. You'll then see on the, it'll say tool calibration, and the z-axis is slowly moving down. It is waiting to touch with the touchpad. Since I have no stock underneath, I'm going to set my z at a fairly high height so that I do not cut into the Sintra. When you're done, the touchpad is magnetic. It goes back onto your machine. When everything is zeroed, you'll see on the screen, this is your origin for X, Y, and Z. They all are zeroed. Now you're ready to start your program. It's as simple as clicking the play button. When you click the play button, the spindle will start up to the proper RPM that it was programmed for. It takes about five seconds, and then it will start the program. This program I wrote up is just a uh, square with a smaller circle inside of the square. I ran this at 16,000 RPM with uh, two passes. It was meant for quarter inch thick wood. When the program is done, the z-axis will raise up, the spindle will stop, and you can remove your stock from the table. And that is the most basic way to function the, any HD machine from Techno CNC Systems. If there are any more questions, you can give us a call at the office, 631-648-7481, and one of our technicians would be happy to help you.